I was hiding the first clue to your Christmas treasure. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys doing? Um, he's singing and then I'm playing. Alright, you keep singing. Good morning. Laura is sick this morning. She started getting a fever last night. We put her to bed and I was hopeful that it was just a fluke and she'd wake up healthy this morning. But she's not. She still has a fever. I actually just took it and it's 102.7. So we're going to spend the day letting her snuggle on the couch and watch movies and praying that none of the rest of us get sick. And yeah, we do have a surprise for this afternoon, so that should be fun. My head hurts and my hand this hurts. Yeah, your waist or your tummy. Are you having a sippy of milk? And snuggling on the couch. Love you, big girl. You can be ready for some nap soon. No. Isaac's doing a school. What are you learning in math today? Improper fractions. Oh. So in the winter time, especially on super cold days, we like to take our blankets and put them in the dryer and warm them up. So we're all super cozy under here right now. Mom needed two eggs and a half pound of flour so she could make pancakes for supper. But who could she send to the market? So we've told the kids that we have a Christmas surprise for them. Well, why do you have a what, paper? You put a paper in, in the, the microwave, microwave. <laughs> and now you're holding it up and you're not letting us see it. I was hiding the first clue to your Christmas treasure hunt. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here is clue Let number me one. You, you, your clue hides under the slide. Project time. The kids are building electrical circuits using batteries, aluminum foil, and cut up Christmas lights. So we got a wire stripper, and Caleb, it's really cool. It doesn't cut all the way through, it just cuts through the outside part. I made a heart card though. Oh, do you need heart bolts too? Caleb, are you stripping that wire? <gasps> he did it. Woo! So that's what we're gonna do. You just built a circuit. But now we're going to make a bigger circuit with a switch. So anytime our kids are working with electric circuits, I think back to my childhood, we had this one house we lived in where you could touch a part of the oven. And then if you touched metal somewhere else, a little electric current would flow through your body. This isn't recommended to try anywhere at home. But we would get a bunch of people to hold hands and get it to flow through all of us. You had an exciting child. It, it was adventurous. <laughs> okay, I think Isaac, like, yours is done. Uh, hey, what let's test it. Okay, your switch is on. Well, well, let's try yeah, let's you do did this it right. Oh, you can. It works! Oh, all right. So turn it Electricity's on. running all through this whole thing. All right. Okay. Yeah. Let's Put test it. He did it! Perfect! This also reminds me of last time Papa was here, we used a clothes hanger to control the garage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Patrick. Yeah. Doesn't work. There's got to be a break in the circuit. There's got to be a break in the circuit. Where's the break? Okay, so there was a piece of tape that was under the wiring, so that's why it wouldn't work. Okay, so that it has to touch directly to this. Okay, put the battery back on and let's check it and see. <gasps> there it is! Woo! Woo Blue and yellow and green and pink. That is so cool. So this is an idea that I found on Pinterest, and you never know if those things are gonna work or not. So I was really excited when that first light lit up. I'm like, yes, this is actually gonna work. This is really fun. Now, Papa's playing with some of the kids, and Grandma is making dessert, and I'm making dinner, and Lisey is, of course, in the kitchen wanting to help us. They are working on Christmas brookies. I think you're a very good, good little cook. And I'm making a meal that I haven't made in years. It's, um, what is it called? Green chili pork burrito enchiladas of awesomeness? I don't know. It's good. I don't know why I haven't made it in a while. <laughs> Caleb, what are you making? I'm making brownies. Brownies. I'm good at eggs. Are you? He's great at eggs. You are very good at eggs. Okay, I know, isn't put it in there. Let's see you dump it in, Cubby. Laura is helping put on the final touches of Christmas sprinkles. Are you helping, Grandma? Yeah. Woo! That looks delicious. That looks great. Are you excited to eat it? Uh -huh. My parents and I snuck out to Walmart to stock up on a few essentials because they say that a storm is coming. It's gonna be super cold and we might be getting some snow. So we wanted to make sure we had milk and eggs and you know, all the basics. On a cold winter's night that was so deep Come and behold him Born the king of angels We want to go caroling to the girls. Three shots. I'm getting one in each arm and one in my bum. I need to call 911. Is this a pizza parlor? 